at the front, Deiru Lagos. They're in a class of their own here. Still rage when Grosjean and Lorac for third and fourth place. They are searching the grip there on the sweeping corners. And Grosjean running wide on that corner there every time, but crucially keeping up his speed. That allows him to pull away down the straight, give himself a bit of an advantage. You can see there different ways of taking that corner. Grosjean taking the uh, big slidey method. Laura behind him, tighter, tidier. Ultimately, just that little bit slower. Darren, of course, miles out in front now. And those wide sweeping lines for Grosjean appear to be paying dividends now. He's starting to pull away from that battle for third place. See the sparks there coming up off the tarmac with those studded tyres. As darkness falls. Again, we see the difference in style there between Deru with his 60 kilos of ballast and Lagorce behind him. Lagorce much tidier, not as sideways, ultimately not as quick either. And there we go then, second victory of the round then for Jean-Philippe Deru. Fantastic performance with maximum ballast on board. In the end, Grosjean, Lorac, Riviere, Panis, Belmondo and Toral rest of the standings there so second day then in San Diego Deru, Prost, Ballas, Grosjean and Lagos the one through five in the standings there lots of points on offer and so what does that do to the overall standings well that gap to six points now Prost over Deru at the top big celebrations there from Deru So Olivia Pan is still third there, but he's now 41 points behind Prost in the race for the title. Ballas in fourth to 